Hi, it's Mark from Orange Rocket again. Hope everyone's doing well. Today I want to talk about the type of adverts that uh, we're using or the type of um, advertising we're using to promote uh, the brands that we work with um, on uh, the Amazon marketplace. So we can see here, this is just a search for uh, kitchen bins. We don't actually work in this category at the moment, but we can see that um, this first page, um, what a lot of people don't realize is actually all ads. So um, the first orga organic position is this one here, this brand here, uh, referred to as the best seller. <clears throat> And what we do know is that approximately 70% of the sales go to these first four positions. So it can actually be quite difficult um, to get organic positions to sell quite well. So what we do is we promote the brand through advertising, which promotes the overall sales, which improves the position that they show. So when you type in a keyword, each keyword phrase has um, a set of results associated with it and the order at which um, product show is quite critical to their sales so you know if you're in these first four positions you're going to be getting the lion's share of the sales these are going to be getting good sales and as you go further down page one page two page three the sales will drop off quite dramatically so <clears throat> this whole page here my screen is adverts so the first one we look at is headline search ads or sponsored brands as they're now referred to as custom image here and three products. You can only use sponsored brands if you've got three products. So there's only one position at the top of the screen uh, and that's a really good seller. Um, good for build, building brand awareness, good for building, um, making people aware of other products. So if this is your really big seller, you can put lower sellers next to it to sort of get the advantage of people um, seeing this product and then obviously seeing that you do alternative you know, colors or or sizes. <clears throat> then these are what we refer to as sponsored product search ads. So they're just conventional ads we're building, bidding on keywords. And then if we scroll down the bottom here, then we've got a video ad. These are really crushing it when it comes to um, sales at the moment. And we're beginning to see um, ads for videos up here as well. So if we just go into um, one of the uh, ads, let's go into the bestseller we can see that once people say, well, actually, I'd like to have a look at this product, then there are other opportunities for us as advertisers to um, try and um, in, get get people to, to buy our product as opposed to the one that they're looking at. So obviously we can see here, this is the predominant um, product that we're looking at. But if we scroll down, um, we can see here four stars and above. So here's potential, providing our product is four stars, here's a potential that we can do what we refer to as product targeting ads. Um, products related to, there's more product targeting ads, and we've got a variety of methods that we can do. Products related, that's all sponsored. So a lot of people don't realize that when they're on listings, a very large percentage of the images and the products that they see are actually paid for ads. So, you know, here we are on that, on, um, this, uh, this, this brand's um, page, but they have no control or limited control over what other products um, show. So we can see all of those sponsored, all of these sponsored, all of these sponsored, um, and then sponsored ads down here, and then obviously we go into the reviews, and there are further sponsored ads down below. Sometimes we see ads in this position here, sponsored display ads, and down here sometimes sponsored display ads. So there's a whole variety of ways at which we can promote um, our products. So we can both, um, on the conventional search results here, then we can promote through sponsored brands and, and, and a whole bunch of search ads. Once people get onto the listing, we can try and persuade them to buy our product. Hopefully we've got a competitive advantage like price or or some sort of feature and we can get them to try and, and do that. Now you can't do that with 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 non with organic. You don't have any mechanism to target competitors or to promote your, your brand other than through sales history and relevancy and things like that. So it's important that you understand and make use of advertising to promote your brand in order to grow sales. 
That's all for today. I hope that's helpful and we'll speak to you again soon. Take care. Thank you. Bye-bye.